What's up, geeks and gamers? My name is Draymond, and welcome to Thorium Gaming. So we're here at another one-off, hanging out with our very own Chaplain Grimaldus. What's up, Chap? And good. we're joined by a member of the 232, DJ Atomica. What's going on, man? Hello. Uh, nice, nice to be here. Nice to be in uh, my first video. <laughs> Alright, so this time we're going to be going back to StarCraft 2. We're going to be playing a game called SCV Team. Um, essentially, it is survive waves and waves and waves and waves and waves of bad guys. Kind of like zombies, only Zerg. So, we're going to jump into this, and we'll see how we do. Should Hopefully this time fun. I don't get myself killed really, really early. Just stay inside the walls this time. Yeah, that would generally help. So, DJ, just want to point out there, man, you're a brand new member of the 232. Thanks for coming aboard. It's glad to have you here. Uh, good to be here. So, the last time we did this, we did succeed, I think. Yep. Well, yep. you guys succeeded. I died and had to end up giving you all my minerals because I was stupid Stuck and bad. The whole time. I went outside the walls. Don't go outside the walls, kids. Outside the walls is bad. There's scary things out there. <laughs> so, essentially, this game mode is SCVs and buildings. You build a power core, you build supply depots to be walls. We're just going to go on that setting because we're still getting used to it. So we have to sit here and start building up a little bit of a fortress. We'll use this as our baseline. Go into our power. Now I have access to the second power because we've done this a few times. So I'm going to toss one of those bad boys down right there. And we're going to build up our walls and everything around it. Apparently have... Or, I guess not the second one. No, I have the second one, don't I? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Wait, no, don't build the wall there. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, so just, uh, we'll extend the wall out this way, and we'll give you room for your power core. I was saying you could probably build it inside, and then we could build an outer, outer layer around it. Yeah. Um, there should still be enough room inside there, um, DJ, for you to set up a power core. That'll work. And uh, remember, it does have a fusion orb in it. If you select it and hit Y, it will start shooting for you. Now this time I was smart and took the better turrets. I took the little guys last time, which was kind of a mistake. But let's see if we can grab a few resources out here before that 20 second timer is done. Is this an encounter laser? I have no clue. I just picked up one myself. Um, that's in the light <laughs> turret section, isn't it? It'll boost, it, the, uh, it'll, it boosts the attack of another defensive structure. Um, increasing range damage fire rate also causes slow and slightly unstable repairs. There was it says. poorly thought out. Eh. It also does damage because no turret in this would not do damage. Battery turret. What one of those? So, as you guys can see, we got lots of waves of Zerg, well, infested things incoming. And our SCVs, unlike normal SCVs, are able to shoot, and shoot very well. All SCVs can do that. Yeah, but their drills in the standard modes are kind of lackluster. So every one of these guys that we kill gives us a little bit more resources. Hey, what did that little robot do? It repairs. That's one of the abilities that I have, just because of the fact that I think I'm host. Yeah, uh, he's... Uh, blah, 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 blah. Grimaldus is playing as player one in this, so he gets access to additional buildings and can call down mule support. Help us repair our walls. You know. Does the laser turret not target? Oh, I guess it doesn't. It does. You just have to kind of point it, point it off of uh, having it boost structures. Targets ground... Uh enemies. I think it's only for... Let me could try it whenever one it was in pops the up. <clears throat> um, careful the bottom right side. I'll lower in one of my supply depots, which acts as our walls, and I'll go build a little additional defense for him here. But essentially, guys, you can use your supply depots like gates to make it a whole lot easier to move around while not exposing yourselves to the enemies. 
I mean, you still can expose yourself. That's the downside. Only if someone forgets to leave the door open. I'm looking at myself. Yep, I was just about to say, like, you last game. Eh, that only happens almost every game, so you should be used to it by now. Oh, I am. Um, I think we lacked a little bit on uh, defenses this time. Yeah, we can pick it I up. No, I think it's those laser turrets of yours. They don't, <laughs> they don't do much. Uh, oh, they they have a shorter range, but they do. They're kind of like a void ray in a way. They do, <laughs> they do do heavy yeah. damage. Your power station, because that's what it looks like. That's what I'm doing at least. Um, I'm just waiting to build a factory. I wonder, are we going to get the ability to have siege tanks this time if you build the factory? I would assume so. Siege tanks would be a big benefit. Mm -hmm. Let me just get back inside here. Thank you, Mule. Hey, did our robot die? Our repair bot? It dies and then comes alive again. Smart enough to stay inside the walls while it was repairing. <laughs> I'm just going to stay inside the walls in general because I don't want to spectate the rest of this round. Yeah, it's going to be a little while until you get back to life. And by a little while, I mean like the next game. So, DJ, aside from StarCraft, what games are you playing right now? <sighs> Man, a bunch of games, to be honest. I've been playing a lot of ARC recently because it finally got released, like the full version. I to play, um... That was the new one. It's, it's alright. I mean, if you like the first one and you like the second one, you like the new one. That's good. Uh, uh, I saw that ARC increased the price from 30 to pre uh, during the alpha to 60. What do you think of that? Well, I mean, it officially got released now, so... I mean, what do you think of the, the price change, though? I'm assuming if you had it in alpha, you didn't have to worry about the price change. Thing with ARC... Like, okay, ARC released DLC while it was still in early access, so that yeah. should tell you all you need to know about the developers of ARC. Yeah, I know. Quick buck. It's a good game, all things considered, it. especially if you have a private server where you can just hang out with your friends. Eh, I, I mean, you can make you can make a server there. Yeah, I'd rather play Rust, in my opinion. Rust, but I like the dinosaurs. I mean, you could probably find a dino dino mod for uh, Rust. N now that it's complete, you can actually uh, beat it. Like, there's actual clear objectives. It's like um, kind of like when they added the bosses in Minecraft in. My friend made a comparison once. I asked him why he didn't like Minecraft, because he loved Terraria. <clears throat> He's like, well, because Terraria has clear goals and has set bosses. It's not like Minecraft when there's you know, one boss and that's it. Uh, so no, Terraria, you you know, you know, defeat the Scourge, you do all this stuff. I mean, I, I never really got into Terraria that much. There's a lot of bosses and stuff in Terraria. There's all the different modes as well. Uh, no siege tanks, by the way, Draymond. Well, that's kind of unfortunate. Never hurts to have yeah. the big guys with the big guns. Of course. I do get Goliaths, though. Well, Goliaths are good, too. Anti-air and anti-land. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which, we are going to be facing enemy air units soon, so we should probably think about getting some air defenses up. Okay. Laser turret, which is for air defenses. Or, against air units, that's what it's supposed to be for. So we have, you know, all the bases covered. Mm -hmm. If you're wondering, the only reason why I have this gap down right here is so if I need to feed the factory units onto your side of the map or the base. Gotcha. Okay, and we'll put one. Down okay, here. so it appears that if the creep oh, no, hits no. our buildings, we can no longer withdraw them into the ground. Yeah, whatever. Interesting. I don't know that. Unless I'm just hitting the wrong button, which is entirely possible. 
I mean, it could be. Pretty uh, air defense setup. So we should be good for that. All the ones in the middle for now, because through it. I chose the wrong heavy weapon. I don't like the psi emitter. Yeah, I found that it's a little lackluster too. I chose the flamethrower this time. Come on. Oh yeah, there you go. Thank you. Now I want to get to that side. Shit. <laughs> I can't get to my side of the base, man. <laughs> oh god, no, don't do the... that. Where are you right now? I don't even know where you are. I'm right in the middle of your factory. Oh, I see you now. I can't, because the laser turret that you put in the, right in the middle, I can't get through. <laughs> they are really pushing this southern place because of all the creep. It's kind of invasive. I'm scared. Oh, I just had to kill me. Whoops. Um. Well, you guys have fun. I'm kind of dead because I uh, accidentally targeted my own lasers. Well, we will see if we can manage to last a little bit. You can use the lasers yeah, to recharge. I can't get through to the top half of the base. Well, Grimaldus um, can still control his units. Just yeah. can't uh, build any new ones. But we do have a factory, so he's still in this by definition. Try going to the south side right here. Me? Oh, yeah. there we go. Yeah, thanks. Alright, now I said I wasn't going outside the walls, and I disregarded my own advice. I mean, I didn't go outside the own walls, I just kind of fried myself with my own laser. Friends don't let friends laser something? I don't know. Uh, I don't know where I was going with that. It's a slow repair technique I'm using. Because now I'm dead. Uh, excuse me. If you if you can't attack, I apologize now in advance. I'm just trying to, or can't place anything. I'm trying to fix. Uh... I just realized it's finally a decent temperature outside. Give me a second. Could open my window. Base is under attack. Okay, so the southern little escarpment. I don't know if that's the right word or not, but that's the word I'm going to go with. It's kind of overrun. That's fine. I'm working with Mass and Goliath right now since I can't do anything else. Now, I don't know how things are where you guys are, but the past week has been, like, really, really hot <laughs> here. Yeah, I, I know the feeling. I'm in California. What is What does that tell you? You've never seen snow in your life. That, uh, that's actually not true. I was in Chicago for about a year last year. So that's now a lie. You don't know what snow oh, yeah, is. <laughs> oh, shut up. I've seen uh, Californian snow. So a nice little frost and a little bit of a, of a sprinkle, maybe. Eh, probably. Well, I live in Canada, so you'd think I would be in a colder place, right? But... Well, just a bit. Well, that really depends on which province like, you're in. It's September. Or late September, even, but, but. Are the hackers ready? I want to see my laser turrets in action. Oh, there we go. Like auto guns. It's getting hard to, uh, keep them out on the western side here. Must target ground units for the laser. Um, I wish I had... Oh, uh, yeah. I wish I had a closer missile turret in range. I would have been able to boost it with my lasers. Well, we're not doing Crap. too bad, all things yeah, considered. 
given that we are down one SCV of the SCV team. Mm -hmm. Um, do you mind dropping this wall down here? Wait. Try, Trey. Thank you. Wall is down. Let your Goliaths out to go have some fun. The walls over here are. I can't build. I can't get there. Build more. Okay, that just fries it. Whoops. Oh god, they're getting through over here. And in my area. <laughs> just hold fast, make sure you guys activate your, uh... Like, DJ, go to your power plant and hit Y. That'll help us out on that side a little bit. Buy us time at the very least. <laughs> Wow, those are the uh, specialist goliaths. Do they actually give you a name for those in the Gorehounds? Gorehounds. I always wondered what they were actually called. It never really says in the campaign. Oh, yeah, not surprised. I know I'm taking a bit of a risk being out here, but I'm just gonna like set up a wall of threads here. I'm going to see if I can slip around and plug the holes that are appearing in our wall. Oh, that's fine. Ooh, I can actually collect the crystal still with my units. This will be fun. So while your SCV may be down and out... into my half of the thing. And just put it, instead of walls, just put a bunch of turrets. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it could work, but then the turrets get damaged easier. Oh, crap, I lost a guy. I hate aberrations. Well, it's a good thing I came back with some walls because your power generator was a little exposed there, DJ. I mean, maybe you want to get rid of your power generator since you don't really need it being dead. Uh, I still can use it. Yeah, he still has turrets and they still take up supply. On top of that, I still can make units. Just like those goliaths that just uh, tore, tore up those uh, infested uh, floaters or whatever they're called. See if we can patch the holes before the next wave starts. But we are very close to being successful, so let's just hold on. I'd uh, help you out, but uh, I have nothing. It's because somebody was a bad boy and went and got himself murdered. Uh, I, I want to experiment with the so. laser. You know, what's the saying? Don't point a laser in your eye? Well, I kind of just proved that saying. Something like that. Lion thumper going, what is that? The what? The... Size thumper. It slows uh, enemies nearby. It's like an air, a slow effect for tower. It's uh, one of the options that you have for your heavy turrets. Personally, I like the flamer. This hole in the wall over here, and over there. And right there. Yeah, they can like walk right through the wall right now. Really. <laughs> Salvages all my walls. Whoops. That should be fun, right? Yeah, let's let's not go and doing that because uh, that would be bad. I mean, it makes for a good video. Maybe, but us dying horribly is something I would like to avoid if at all possible. Yeah. There will be plenty of time for that when we do another horror uh, survival uh, game. Drop the wall! Drop the wall! Drop the wall! Drop the wall! Walls down. Get in! Get in! Thank get in! You. Get in! Get in! Get in! And walls up. I could use a couple repairs if you don't mind repairing my glass. What is that model for the wall? Is it like some kind of power generator? Or what? It's the nope. supply depot. Okay. Makes sense why I haven't seen it. Because you don't play Terran. <laughs> she doesn't have them. No, I said Terran. Nova's a little bit different. 
she's no. Dominion, but I don't hate her, which makes me you feel weird. Ghost. God, um, our east wall is... Yeah, I know, I see that. Activate the power generators. Ooh, I gotta get out of there. They're killing me, killing me, killing me, killing me, killing me. Ooh. Set up a bunch more, uh... Anti-air turrets. At this point, I'm just trying to keep what we got alive, because we're 250 kills away from winning. I could use a couple of repairs. Yeah. I only see one of your guys that's hurt, dude. That's fine. Thank oh, you. God, I fucked up. I can't go there. Do I have enough for a laser battery turret? Yes, I do. I'm that. trying to let you guys have space and also try to keep yeah, my. What are you doing? Uh, oh, yeah. I dropped the wall again. Uh, R, if you click on it. Base is under attack. Oh my god. I have no Something. idea where my SCV is in this mess. Uh, there's one here, and there's one down here. Both of them are down by my factory, in between my Goliaths. Yeah, I, I found myself and I'm um, repairing your Goliaths. That's fine. To hopefully get us through this. If you right-click on uh, your repair, it auto-casts. I'm stuck in this little spot. That's a good thing and a bad thing, right? Not enough I suppose. We have, well, like, that would explain more... why their uh... people is gone. I can't build anything. I can probably blow up my power generator if you want to replace it. Just hold on, we're so close. Just another 20 kills. I can't even get up there anyway, so... The <laughs> Eight more. Come on, five. Wave after four, we get the three, kills. Two, one. Yes! Nice. We made it. If only just. You realize we still have to survive the wave? No. At least if few more seconds question mark what sure. <laughs> <laughs> just oh, ran off <laughs> um, oh, DJ's running nice. like victory is ours <laughs> we had nothing really. left at the very end of that but that was awesome <laughs> congratulations DJ you run away like brave Sir Robin <laughs> yeah I just dated myself, didn't I? Because you've never seen Monty Python in the Quest for the Holy Grail. I have. I have not. I have. You, you got a you gotta half uh, chuckle out of that one. Um, essentially, Brave Sir Robin, his entire theme song is about running away. I keep meaning to watch that, but... It's it's worth the time. It really is. It's hilarious. <laughs> rabbit. What, you mean behind the rabbit? No, he is a rabbit. <laughs> Some call me Tim, the Enchanter. Wait, is that the one with that guy who was like, just but a scratch? Yep. Yeah, the green, black the knight. Black Knight. Your arm's off. No, it's not. <laughs> All right. So what are we doing this time, Grim? Uh, I assume going back to normal rotation is probably better, right? We could do that, or we could do a the Starship Troopers map and have a little bit your, of a goof off on there. Your choice. Well, let's split the difference. DJ, what are we doing? A regular rotation map, or are we going to go play Starship Troopers? Yeah. Eh. Are the Starship Troopers games long? Uh, not Depends long. Depends on how long you can hold it. Troopers and then switch to regular rotation. That's All fine. Right. So we're going to go in, and we're going to try and defend ourselves as Starship Troopers. I am playing Zim, because I actually really like Zim. Do we get nukes? I don't know what? if we get Damn nukes. It. But DJ, off my teal. Thank you. <laughs> you guys and your colors. What? I'm, I'm repping are... Thorium Gaming. I got to be the light blue. That's part of my channel. Just has to be that way. Don't this judge way me. You also don't have. As a portrait wise, guess what? Guess what else you don't have? Yeah, Nova. And you guys keep rubbing it in. No, I, I keep trying to rub it in. I don't know about uh, uh DJ over there. Ah, well, like I keep saying, it doesn't matter if you're laughing at me or laughing with me, as long as you're laughing and having fun, 
right? Mm -hmm. You get double income if your partner leaves. I'm doing my part. Oh, man, I love that part. <laughs> I love those commercials. All right, so you pick your hero. Ones? I'm taking Zim, and my entrance is the top one up here. First thing you should probably do is get your barracks up and running. <clears throat> uh, DJ, which guy did you uh, choose to start off with? Butter, of course. All right, so my wall is the top one. DJ, I'm thinking that you're the right, and Grim, you're the left. Yep. You know it. All right. Oh God, it's the Starship Troopers music. Oh, yes, so great. yes, it is. So get up on the wall. If you can get right up to the edge, DJ, right in the center, like right there, you'll be able to shoot them as like they come they do in. in the movies. They like they do this like swarming thing where they can move in a circle. Yep, and here they come. You might want to get some Marines up. You're going to need them. As soon as I get some minerals stored up here, I am going to drop my armory, start researching weapon upgrades. Oh, and make sure you go into your hero, DJ, and bottom left corner, or bottom right corner, I should say, there is a level up button. You have specialist skills with your character. Let's see, learn stim pack. Eh. There should learn be a bunch of options. Plasma gun. That requires hero level six. I want. The... Uh, uh, you chose the Mar Marauder, correct? Yeah. Okay, uh, you heard the Starship Troopers. Marauder is the only way to go. <laughs> Did you see that new Starship Troopers animated movie? I actually quite enjoyed it. Yeah, it was it was really decent. I I loved it. I liked the sniper chick, but then again, me and ghosts, right? Of course. Um, and DJ, you can promote your marines to um, better things later on, ghosts and specters. Wait until they get some veterancy because their veterancy sticks with them. And Zim has leveled up. See, this is one of those points in gaming where you got to make a tough choice. Do I want another gun on the wall, or do I want weapon upgrades? Both are good. Mm -hmm. Oh, the uh, supply is very small. And how did that happen? Oh shit, they can get up the wall? Yeah. Yeah, these are special zerglings. They can... well, they're not zerglings, they're bugs. <laughs> bugs! I gotta watch Starship Troopers again. It was a good movie. I mean, the second one was. Let's not talk about the second one. But the first one was really good. The second one was a bit shitty. It looked like a student film, like a really low budget student film. Yeah, and they cut out the whole bunch of the cast of characters, right? But the animated movie that brought all those characters back, and it was just but my enjoyable. guys are dying. Oh, you're sending your airstrike over to help him? Yep. Each one of us only gets one of those per. That's fine. I also get more minerals. 40 seconds. And I just you're lost just Marine. The whole point of the tail rotor is so that they don't start spinning. If you have two spinning in opposite directions, start spinning anyway, so I don't understand why it has a tail rotor. <laughs> Video okay, I'm going to have to call in my support to help out DJ here while he gets his troops up. We could use some help here. <sighs> How very ladylike. Thank you. I appreciate it. Whoa. Right, let's get a second medic up there. You said for Marauders or Hydralis, which one was the better unit for it? Um, I believe for Hydralisks, you're looking at Ghosts or heavier <laughs> units like that. Gotcha. 
We're now oh, onto God. the leapers. Jump over the wall like nobody's business. Mm-hmm. Someone lose a guy? Uh, I'm still doing pretty good. I got a paramedics up here. <laughs> paramedics. Um, <laughs> we're holding on pretty decently. I'm trying to save up for a fire bat. Looks like yeah. DJ's in a bit of trouble. Again. Yep. He just killed everyone. Die, I get like a bunch. Oh no! Oh. I'm just gonna, like... We are in definite trouble right now. Alright, so I'm going to rebuild my barracks. Oh, yes. I'm going to try and get some marines up to help out. Roaches. Remember your training, and you will make it back alive. The doctor is in. Somehow, I'm severely doubting that quote right now. Well, I mean, they should have been doubting it, because they all fucking died. <laughs> Still, the best quote marines? in that entire game er, movie belonged to Zim. An enemy cannot push a button if you disable his hand. Base is under attack. Not enough minerals. His marines are so squishy. Not enough minerals. Starship troopers marines. As they uh, gain veterancy, like if you look at my marines up here, they get 10% extra hit points and at every 10 kills, but we are getting overrun, so... Fall back into the compound. I don't think we're going to have a dramatic dropship rescue for this one. Game Run. over, man. Game over. Wait, wrong alien Sneak franchise. It's the only way to be sure. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I like the swords. Alright, well, that was entertaining. So let's uh, throw into a regular rotation game and uh, see if we get ourselves after that. So what do you want to do? Meaning just a regular multiplayer game? Uh, do you guys want to do a comp stomp or a free for all? Uh, free for all. Three for all. Three for all. Yeah, that works too, a three for all, technically. <laughs> I, I leave it up to you guys because. You're, you're my community. It's Please what I gotta what do. Comp stomp is. We go in and we stomp down on the computer players. I like that. But... I feel like a three v three or a three or a free for all would be fun. All right, well, let's do it and see if we can get a little cheeky. I mean, uh, remember our incident of the widow mines from the other night? I don't like your widow mines. We're not bringing those up. I like them. They worked very well for me. Why am I a spectator? Uh, yeah, I, we went into the wrong map type, it looks like. Nope. There we go. Bump him up to team three. Yep. Automatically my color. Oh, that's because I took I took my teal rat off the bat, so... Which seems I, I would wish you all luck, properly. but I really hope you lose. You say that now, but I know that the cheapest way you're going to win is if you go for an econ line. Well, it depends. I don't know what I'm playing as, so it could be... A Zergling rush, it could be a Zealot rush, it could be a Marine rush. Don't know. Gonna be a rush is what you're saying. It's gonna <laughs> be a rush anyway. We're sitting down playing StarCraft. We're having fun. You say that now, but wait until I get Widow Mines. It's gonna be fun then. So, uh, DJ, do you want to have a small truce? No. Wait, like, you're that scared of my sure Widow Mines? I don't like your Widow regular Mines. Regular StarCraft? I don't think I've ever played a regular game of StarCraft. I've only ever played the co-op missions. We played earlier, remember? That was regular. Yeah. Remember we did like easy AI, medium AI, and then all of a sudden we got stomped by three hard AIs? <laughs> that was pretty funny. Eh, uh, funny for you. Next thing I know, my base is blown up. You so. look away for a second, and then bad things happen. Usually how it goes, right? Additional supply depots required. I just had a weird burp. 
You ever get those burps where like it tickles your nose? No. You haven't? It's like a fizzly up your nose. Might this is coming from a guy who chews on Warhead candies. Uh, hey, you, you can't, you can't dis uh, disclaim the Warhead candies. Dude, anyone who eats those things is automatically slightly masochistic. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> uh, you know the sour candies you can find usually at like Dollar Tree or some sort of like a grocery store or stuff like that? They're called Warheads and yes. they're like that for a reason. They are so sour. I uh, can usually eat about five of them in a day before I have to call it quit. Call me five crazy. Day. I can make me get through five in a month and I feel like I want to die. <laughs> they're stupidly sour. I mean, they're fun. In my opinion, at least. Oh, man. So which one's which in terms of where you guys are on the map? Uh, you can't see pings, but usually the one player's at the top, one player's at the side, and one player's at the bottom. Where you two are, it's just, I'm not sure which one is which. That's the fun Now, why would we tell you up. that? There's, there's no surprise in that. I, I could be the top one, you could be the bottom, or he could be the bottom one. Or the side one. One of the ones, what? I don't know. I don't know. Cash. What's up? Oh. It's fun to know. Someone has orbital. I'm going to be assuming that's you, uh, Draymond. I'm going to let you assume whatever the heck you want to assume. Well, you played random, so that uh, fills me in because he's playing Protoss. Shh, don't use logic. Oh, log logic already achieved. There you go. See, the question is now, can I get to you before you get to me? The question is, am I actually doing a rush or am I not? No, you're probably going to turtle. And then do a rush when you have more supplies. Because either A, you do a rush at the start, or B, you do uh, like a built-up force and then push with that. Weird terminology, rush, turtle, I have no fucking... Idea. Turtle <laughs> is uh, just like bulking your defenses so they can't get in. And then rushing, of course, is just taking a force and seeing how much damage you can do. Hopefully to counter or to beat them. Like an early game move. One comes down to unit count in the early game, one comes as, you know, you build up as much of the tech tree as you possibly can. Now you guys are seeing what I'm doing, probably laughing at me for the inefficient and utterly bad I way that I play build. StarCraft. You're gonna build ghosts. Now why would I do that? That's your favorite unit, it's self-explanatory. Hey. Who's doing something yellow to me? That's him. No, no it's not. There's two Terran players on the map. I'm not yellow. Yellow means... Yellow I'm not yellow either. Color. If Here you press the alt F, you might be... Stuff. Huh? What's up? Imperial Guard where you could satellite view someone's stuff? Yeah, if you go to your uh, command center, there's the uh, orbital command upgrade. Or you're not playing uh, Terran, never mind. You're playing Protoss. You have to build observer, observers if you want to see someone, uh, someone's base then. I don't want to build observers. Why? They're your best friend. Nice expansion you got going on there. Oh, hi. Nice Protoss army. Add on complete. What the hell? Oh, I didn't even tell them to do that. They will follow automatically if there's an enemy unit close enough. Yes, did you try something? I admit nothing. This better be good. You like to admit nothing, but uh, in all reality, you tried something. Oh, oh god, what the hell is going on? What's uh, going on what? Who wants some? I don't remember the upgrade trees. Uh oh. Actually, wait, I need a lot more of... Uh, uh, pylons or whatever you call them. Yep, pylons, those giant blue crystals.
complete. Have ever seen? Ah, StarCraft. Bringing friends together to shoot one another for years and years. Yeah, pretty much. Usually how it goes, right? Most of the time. I mean, some of the Sometimes. time it's not shooting, some of the time it is stabbing. Just nuking. Nah, stabbing, nuking from orbit, you know, all the fun stuff. I feel like nuking from orbit's going to become like a catchphrase or something with us. Eh, especially you. What a nice looking base you have going on. I don't know. What are you doing? You can tell us. You know, we won't. We won't tell anybody else. Yeah, you know, just me, myself, and I over here. As soon as I figure it out, I'll let you know. Is that a good sign? Bad sign? I'm gonna go with the bad sign, probably. <laughs> I mean, bad for me, maybe. <laughs> Research complete. Maybe his strategy is just so complex, even his own mind can't figure it out. <laughs> he can't even formulate it himself. He just, he has something in mind, he just doesn't know what. Definitely what's going on. Isn't that usually how it goes? Well, with me, I kind of make a plan, scrap it immediately, because the plan was stupid. And then <laughs> I make another plan, which is equally as stupid, and I go with it because I got nothing else. We'll go gadget. That's being gas. <laughs> Doesn't quite work like that, but good try. That's... Not enough energy. Hey, look, bunkers cost normal price this time. That feels good. I'm actually surprised that no one has said anything about the giant circles randomly appearing on their map. Oh. You see it now? Yeah. I saw it, I just didn't care. Oh. Well. Circles do. They it's... just say, um, they just give me movement effect. Like, they'll show me what movement is happening in that area. That's all. It's nothing too spectacular. Be easier if I just did this. Nice, you're going aerial. Oh, hi. Nice siege tank you have on the cliff. Just watching out for what's mine. Yeah, fair enough. Depleted. Like about the Protox is that you don't have to, your builder doesn't have to wait for the building to finish before you can they go can back to walk away, I know. Lucky you. Huh? Ah, I always forget my tech trees. I always forget my tech trees. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Let's see if I can go this way. I can't. That explains that. You know, it does keep you guessing. I mean, I never know what you guys are up to. Uh, I mean, I think I just did a surprise hit and run on him. <laughs> I got my ears on. Roger that. Turbines to fall. It was actually overpopulated with workers, so thanks for that. Oh, you're welcome. I'm glad I can clear it out for you. Anytime. Can do. Weapons hot. Oh no. You and your stupid I know Really we're gonna have this game again? You build sensor towers outside of my base. And? You build sensor towers outside of my base. And? Maybe he just built a... You built a base outside of his sensor towers. Have you ever considered that?
God damn it. What the hell is going on? Harassment tactics. Upgrade complete. I believe it's pronounced harassment. My law teacher in grade nine would always say that. Oh, it's actually pronounced harassment. Really? I told you you were gonna go for an econ rush. Well, that's not, not really going. a rush, it's more of a... Just annoy you if I can. And there's the infamous Widow Mines. Told you. Did I not tell you they were happening? I guess what? Bye. That's okay, Banshees did what they had to. Paid for themselves. Sadly. How are you even making an observer? Uh, robotics bay. Mineral field depleted. And again, for all the expert StarCraft players out there, please don't laugh at me too much. I know I'm bad. Laugh at them all you want. You're just jelly. I'm not jelly of anything. Actually, I think he's more annoyed than jealous. Eh, not too bad. Diva, I know pylons. Fuck. <laughs> Seems like you're having fun with Diva. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. I told you to turn it off after the last game we did. Did I not? Upgrade huh? complete. Didn't I tell you to turn it off after the last game we did? Yeah. But you know how some people are. They just never listen. <laughs> no listening. Okay, someone's gonna hurt me for that one. That was... I don't know what that was supposed to be. I don't know either. If you don't know, we don't know, right? Don't know what, what? You guys might know. I, I don't know. His impersonations or his little voice that he was doing. All I'm pretty sure of is that my godmother would hurt me for it. Most likely. I wouldn't be surprised. Woe is me. Mineral field depleted. Oh, you've cloaked. <laughs> oh, I uncloaked you. You would need observers. Or, yeah. Oh. Well, they got slaughtered. I'm really hoping that this strategy works, and I very highly doubt it will. What strategy is my question? What strategy indeed? The nuking one, probably? There is no nuclear option. Nuclear option as uh, Terran, just to let you know. Go ahead. Mineral field depleted. Yes, sir. Have it. Oh. Go to Diva. Big job. Ready to blunder. Yes, I know the minerals are gone, Diva. Thank you. My question is, where's the nuke? Was that on my base or his is the question? Well, I think DJ actually just whooped me because uh, I got nothing. Absolutely <laughs> nothing to defend against this. Is under attack. Way to go, DJ. Oh, he's going to whomp you too. Nothing's over yet. 
I'm breathing. No. So the question is, if you want to help me, was it aerial, aerial or ground base? God. Where are you calling those? Because I hear them. I feel like they're not on me, though. No, I'm attacking him. That was an interesting shot. Well, if I'm gonna die, I'm gonna go down fighting. Hey, you're supposed to attack me. Oh, jeez. All right. I want, to the, I want to see the fight from here. What happened, Dre? Did you get uh, not enough air support? Um, we both left DJ alone and screwed with each other, and it ended up biting me in the butt big time. You do realize that I attacked him a few times, right? But apparently it helped him with his supply cap. I mean, it was like by accident, though. Yeah, and DJ has officially beat me, so GG DJ. This should be fun then. Three. Are you just going to spectate now or something? Uh, there's actually not a spectator option in the defeat menu. I mean, you could probably try to return the game unless it says score screen. Uh, it does say score screen on my side, so. Oh, okay. I, I wish you all the best. Catch up with you after. All right. Well, uh, since I got knocked out here early, which is pretty much par for the poor course, and it's been a pretty decent episode sitting out here and chilling. Um, if you guys like the video, please consider hitting that like button. If you'd like to join the 232 and possibly come in here and game with me, DJ, and of course our own Javelin Grimaldus, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn your notifications on so you don't miss a video when they come up. So until next time, guys, remember, life's a game, play to win. Take care.